Hello, my lovely YouTubers. Welcome to the channel of a loquacious one. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is doing fine and staying safe during this pandemic. I am dropping by, by with a little haul on things you can get. Perhaps you have a small family, just you and probably one or two others. You don't use much medicine. You're just building a little emergency kit. Um, I would say the most economical way to do over-the-counter medicines is to give them when they're on sale and stack a coupon on top. But again, this is not medical advice. I'm putting this disclaimer in. I'm not a medical practitioner of any kind. Consult your physician, especially if you have any health challenges. We don't want you to get hurt. Okay? It can be devastating. And be careful what you take. Also, educate yourself on the different pain relievers. And how they affect you and how you should take them. I look at uh, the Patriot Nurse or something of that sort. But check YouTube for your own self-information as a guideline. Check your medical practitioner first and foremost. And talk to your pharmacist when getting any, uh, any um, pharmaceutical. So that you may be aware. Also, let your doctor know everything you're taking. That includes any diets you are on, any vitamins, supplements, any herbs that you're also taking. Because something can negate something else. Again, knowledge is power. So again, with COVID-19 being around, you always want something in your house. I know medicines are expensive, but you want something in your house in case you, you know, um, get sick and it comes upon you quickly. You don't have any transportation are you too ill to, you know, just go to the store? You don't feel your best. Keep all different types of medications that suit your body type around. So you don't have to hurry and be stressed. Don't have the money and all that other hoopla. So I'm going to show you some of the ones that I generally take. Not going to give you any information how to take it. Because again, I don't want nobody saying I caused them to do something. Because I said do this. I'm just going to briefly tell you what they are. First one is Advil which is ibuprofen. It is 200 milligrams. It's six coated tablets in this little, I call it a travel size box. So that's three two count packets. And I generally put these in my uh, first aid kit that I have in my car, or if you wanna keep one at your desk, or if you're traveling, this would be good to build that little first aid kit. Uh, they also have Advil liquid gel if you prefer. It is stabilized ibuprofen capsules, 200 milligrams, and it's four liquid capsules in two packs. Okay, so Advil is a pain reliever fever reducer. Okay, it's an NSAID. That means a non steroidal anti-inflammatory drug. Next is um, Advil PM, and it is four coated caplets. Okay, capsule shape is two two count packets. It is an ibuprofen 200 milligrams with di diphenhydramine citrate to help you sleep at night. Next, I have Aleve all day strong. Aleve is naproxen sodium tablets 220 milligrams. It's also a pain reliever, fever reducer. It is by Bayer's. It's an NSAID, which is non steroidal anti inflammatory drug. And the strength it says to last six to last twelve hours. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know if they have a, a lead PM. I'm not for sure, but I do like a lead. Uh, next is the tried and true. The first one I ever took, genuine aspirin Bayer. Bayer is a net inside a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug, pain reliever, fever reducer. The wonder drug it says 325. 325 milligrams. You see it has a little heart symbol, which says it's safe pain relief plus life-saving benefits in six coated tablets. So what this is, is most people will take a prescribed amount with the consent of their doctor, or if you have an onset of a heart attack or some kind of uh, cardiac arrest, this may save your life before you get to the doctor. But caution People that have stomach ulcers, people that are on blood thinners, you have to ask your practitioner if you can use this. 
because this is a blood thinner. So be careful. Ask your doctor. Anything here you see that I take, ask your doctor first. You're not me and I'm not you. Next, this is my favorite for headaches. I have two of them. I don't know the difference between them. They're both the same to me, but it's Excedrin, Extra Strength, Acetophen, Acetophenamine, Aspirin, which is insect, and Caffeine. It's a pain reliever, a pain reliever A. It's three packets of two capsules. And this is Excedrin, Migraine, Acetophenamine, Aspirin, which is insect, and Caffeine. Same thing. I don't see the difference except one is in the green pack, one is red. They both have the same amount of everything, it seems. Yeah. It's basically no difference. And I don't get it. But, hey, I love uh, etc. Next is um, Motrin, which is an ibuprofen. It says Motrin IB. It's an NSAID, nostril anti-inflammatory drug. It's 200 milligrams. It's four coated caplets. So that's two. It's a blister pack, I believe. It probably would be a blister pack. I'm not sure. I believe this is a blister pack. So if you like Motrin, Dollar Tree has the Motrin. And again, I'm suggesting you use these in your first aid kit for, you know, your glove compartment, work, even at home if you have a, you know, very rarely use medicine, I very rarely use medicine, and I end up dumping it, and it's too expensive to do that, so I use this so I can use it up, or if I get rid of it, I haven't spent too much. Next, we all know this, is Tylenol Acetophytamine, a pain reliever fee reduced to extra strength. It has three gold packs with two capsules each and each capsule is 500 milligrams each yep and we're familiar with Tylenol okay so that would be something that you would ingest to relieve pain Okay, folks, something else I do for pain relief is I use Epsom salts. Again, very cautiously, especially if you have hypertension or diabetes or something. Um, not just calling those out, but any health challenge. Ask your doctor, do not just use it because it's over the counter. It can contradict current medications and cause serious health issues. But I use a... a, a also, if you have circulation problems. But this is the Sure Relief Sore Muscle and Back Soap Epsom Salt. It's natural magnesium sulfate crystals. And it has the added fragrance and germy. They add the oil. This is eucalyptus scented. It's soothing relief from overexertion and stiffness from muscle cramps, soreness, and fatigue. Calming and relaxing soak aid. They also have just the plain... Um, Epsom salt, and also I have one with spearmint in it, okay? If it has peppermint in it, that's another um, good one to use. So you can find these all over. They have very scents. But generally the ones you would use for therapeutic soaks would be eucalyptus, spearmint, peppermint, menthol, those type of uh, fragrances. And they just have a regular non-scented one. You can also use this one, 70% isopropyl alcohol. They have 50% some time, but I haven't seen it since the pandemic. And it's 16 ounces. So alcohol is alcohol to me. This 70% is good for rubbing down your muscles. They, I also use, um, they have a wintergreen one, which is the green alcohol, as they call it. And they have one that's red. Okay. I'm not showing those only because Dollar Tree doesn't have them, but I do use them. So you can use the clear one, the uh, green one with wintergreen. It generally has wintergreen in it. And they have the red one, which I've seen. It has capsation in it. I don't know exactly because I've seen a couple of different formats with the red alcohol. 
But if that's no problem for you and you know your body and you ask your physician, by all means partake. But again, ask your physician. Okay? We don't want to get ill. We don't want to get hurt. We want you to be healthy. Okay? As well as you could use ice packs. Now, this is a short ice pack. It has a lid that you unscrew. And these come in various colors. I just got this one in pink. And this is for a smaller general localized area. It's reuses it. It's reusable. I'm sorry. It soothes bruises, swelling, soreness, and pain. Okay. You fill with ice cubes for cold therapy. Okay. Now, if you have hot water bottles in your home or you have some dish bags that convert, you can also use that. Um, if you have swelling, okay, and pain, you might want to ice it down. And if it's a bruise, um, if you have stiffness and soreness, you might want to use heat. Again, ask your doctor or your physical therapist, okay? Do not just haphazardly use things, okay, because they're available. Now, I might go, they have all kinds of rubs and creams at Dollar Tree, and I'm not going to show you all of those, because I need something a little bit stronger, and those generally do not work for me, so I am not going to even show you. What I just found, and I'm just going to show you these, are some that's close to what I get from my physical therapist, and I'm going to try them, because I get my pain relieving gels and rubs, and a lot of my pain relieving creams from my physician or my physical therapist because of conditions I have. But from Dollar Tree, to the Dollar General, Dollar General, DG Health is their store brand. This says it compares to the active ingredients in BioFreeze Gel, which I get BioFreeze Gel from my physical therapist. You can also purchase BioFreeze Gel at Walmart. It's around anywhere from 12 to 15 bucks. So I was happy to try this because it was $4. It's cold zone. Pain relieving gel, topical relief, menthol 4%, topical analgesic for arthritis, backache, muscle pains, joint pains, soothing menthol paraben free is two ounces and four bucks. So I will try that and let you know. As well as I found this, I tried this and it seemed to be all right. It compares to as ingredient of oil free aspirin with 4% lidocaine, which lidocaine has a numbing effect. It's odor free. It's maximum strength pain relieving cream with uh, right okay, four percent no irritant, no irritation, no burning, no, and it's non greasy, one point seven five ounces, and it too was about, um, I want to say four bucks, but I'm not for sure. But they were all, you know, relatively inexpensive. Okay, folks, another over-the-counter um, pain relief type system you can use are the patches. This, I got at Dollar Tree. All of these, except the one I'm going to show you, came from Dollar Tree. A couple of came from Dollar General. But this is their care pain therapy by Viridian Healthcare. It says it compares to the active ingredients in Salon Paws Hot Capsation Patch. And you can get salon pods generally at stores like uh, Walgreens. I know Walgreens has it. And maybe Walmart. But this is a targeted warming capsation heat pack for back and large areas temporary relief of aches and pains. It's a topical analgesic, no mess, long-lasting pain relief. A single-use uh, application. It stays put with this adhesive patch. And it's two patches that are 5.25 inches by 7 inches. And these were a dollar. I got about four of these. And I got this Absorbing Junior Plus Pain Relief Back Patch. It's 5% alcohol. It's extra large, uh, non-greasy, comfortable, breathable, stays securely when extra large. Medicated patch is 9 by 4 And it lasts up to 8 hours. As well as this Absorbing Junior Plus Ultra Strength Pain Relief is 6.5% menthol for shoulder, arms, neck, and legs. Relieves sore muscles and arthritis pain, deep penetrating, no, non messing, comfortable, breathable stays put. One large medicated patch, five and a half by four inches. Okay, so this is 
technically in a larger pack. And all this is like, I don't know what all this is about. Um, maybe it's just to hang it, but there's too much packaging to me for a patch that's smaller. And it is menthol too, but it's a little bit more menthol in the Absorbing Junior Plus. It's different. This is a brand um, that I found at Dollar Tree also. Coralite Muscle and Joint Extra Strength Pain Reef Patch. It's topical analgesic. Uh, camphor 1.2%, menthol 5.7%, and methyl salicylic at 6.3%. Temporary relief for minor aches and pains. Ideal for back and large areas. Two patches that are 4.9 inch by 3.3 inches. It says, caution, this product contains natural rubber latex, which may cause allergic reactions. So you want to be cautious of this. And this says it compares to the active ingredients in original Salon Paz large pain relieving uh, patch. So just so you know that. Okay. And I also found, now all these name brands. I found from Dollar General this Absorbing Junior Plus Maximum Strength Lidocaine patch. It's 4% lidocaine, target pain relief numbs away pain. Lidocaine basically numbs. It's like when you go get your tooth worked on, they numb it with lidocaine. It's odor free, fast acting, deep penetrating, comfortable breathable, and stays on security for shoulders, arms. Neck and legs is one large Medicaid patch, five and a half by four inches. Again, consult your doctor if this would be something for you. And also, another lidocaine product that I got from a Dollar General. This was a dollar at Dollar General. This was like a dollar fifty. It's the Dollar General. It says compares to the active ingredients in aspirin cream. Lidocaine uh, patch, maximum strength lidocaine pain relief patch, 4% anesthesia, one large patch for neck, shoulder, legs, and back, 3.93 inches by 5.51, uh, lasts up to 12 hours, odor free, fast acting, no mess, stay put, flexible patch. Okay, and that is it. Things that you can get that don't cost a whole lot. That you can relieve pain and inflammation. Inflammation. Um, just to highlight again, if you have a hot water bottle, you can use that. If you have a dish bottle and it has a plug, you can use that. If you need to um, reduce inflammation um, or you overexert yourself working out, um, you can fill a solar bottle. You know, if it's empty, rinse out water and freeze it and roll your foot over that or the back of your uh, knee um, you can also make a solution of water and alcohol they have recipes all over youtube i'm sure and make a slushy and use it put it in a um, ziploc bag put it in the freezer and you always have one um, they have baby gel teething rings that you can use there's a lot of things you can use for pain relief do not suffer in pain needlessly, but pain is the body crying out for help. So this is just temporary. If you experience pain of any kind, if it's excruciating, if it's ongoing, please, at the very soon as you can, consult your medical practitioner. And that is all. This is Equations 1 coming at you with another haul of affordable things you can get to stay well and stay healthy during this trying times okay until next time i'm going to ask you if you're not a part of my youtube family if not why not subscribe it doesn't cost you anything it's free thumbs up this video so you can put my video in rotation as well as share it on social media if you have any questions cares comments concerns if you learn anything or if you just want to be nice please subscribe till next time leave all the questions in the box below bye bye